everybody Paula here out here in the backyard I got some charcoals in the charcoal chimney firing up and today I'm gonna make something that I've had haven't had in a long time but it's a, it's a recipe we made in the Navy uh, it's also kind of like a cowboy food that item is called chuck wagon stew so this is it we got two pounds of Bush's baked beans, two, two different styles, a country style and original. And then you got two small yellow onions and one green pepper. Got one pound of ground beef. And we're gonna squirt some ketchup in there. It's gonna be good. But we're waiting for the coals to get ready. This is gonna be cooked in the Lodge 3.2 combo cooker. I use it as a Dutch oven many times and we're going to use that lodge stand and we're just waiting for them charcoals to get fired up it's going to be good so let's just say this i would have used firewood or wood you know but it's a race against time. The sun is about to go down. So time is the issue here. Charcoals is going to be fine. This is an easy cook. But I don't think many people know about this recipe. Yet thousands do. <laughs> so I think these charcoals are good enough. There's fire coming out of the top. So let's dump this in there. Looking good. So first thing I'm gonna throw down on there is this ground beef. Try to break that up. a little frozen inside that'll be okay one pound it'll get cooked off let's just put the lid on That hamburger's finally getting broken up a little bit with my help. <laughs> so right now, let's go ahead and add these green peppers and onion, which I'll do right now. Let them saute with the fat and the meat. tell you what plates bowls my wife is rough with the stuff she she puts chips and cracks in every plate and bowl we got check this out I think it's time to throw this one away <laughs> that's her signature right there I've seen her work this is what she does she chips up still Get this lid back on here. Now them them charcoals. 
it's not as hot as I expected, but it's gonna work. I wanna make sure it works. <laughs> it's time to open up a little bit of the good stuff. Oh, you're wondering what it is. The good stuff. Coke Zero. The good stuff. That's all I need. Let's see how it looks since the lid's been on there a while. Ooh, a double shot. That, folks, was my phone. That was not a real rifle. Oh yeah. Well, it's not as hot as I'd like, so I'm gonna go with a little plan B. I think in the last video I did, I was saying I was gonna do a beef stew video. You know, video cooking, making beef stew. Well, I did it. And in the end, my footage, I don't know, somehow or another, I didn't press record at one point. Probably the most critical point of a video. Won't be the first time, won't be the last. 16 ounces per can. And we all know 16 ounces is a pound, so I got two pounds of bush beans. Right now we'll go with the, the original baked beans. And then we'll go with the country style baked beans. A little cornucopia of bush beans. Give that a little stir. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's my phone, folks. It's not a real rifle. Put the cover on. Let it cook a little bit. It sucks when the sun goes down fast. Can't stand it. about uh, I'll say a cup that 
that ketchup gives it a little bit of saltiness, a little bit of sweetness, and a little tang. Now it's looking right. Now it's looking familiar. <laughs> All right, you see, I got a bowl here. You know, let's take the lid off. Take a look. Looking great. Now it's time to get a taste. So here it is in the bowl. You can see the meat in there, peppers, onions, beans of course there's more beans than any other ingredient I'm gonna about to have a flashback to my Navy days all right here we go that is great One piece of advice, don't eat this on a work night. <laughs> I could eat this whole, this, the whole thing. Folks, <laughs> say it, don't spray it. Chuck Wagon stew is so good. It'll warm your soul. It'll heat your bed. And uh, it is outstanding. It's economical. Try it at home. Highly advise it. I totally forgot about this recipe. And we at my work, we started talking about Old Navy recipes. And this is one of them that popped up. And... I just had to do it again. Coke Zero. So, until next time, I'm Paulie. Never trust a skinny cook. And I'll see you later. Man, that's good. Cool.